Mrs. Royal Parrots here. Today we're going to talk about how to DNA sex a bird with blood. A customer of ours asked us to do this video because this is actually a process that a customer themselves can do at home. There are a few reasons why a customer would not do it at home. There are a few things that can freak people out about DNA sexing a bird with blood. But today we're going to talk about how to do it at home and what those things are that freak people out about DNA in a bird at home. These are a few things that you're going to need. You're going to need Quick Stop Septic Powder. You don't necessarily need the brand Quick Stop. You just need septic powder to stop the bleeding once you cut the nail. You'll need a pair of nail trimmers and the DNA cards that you see right there in the corner. Be very careful using the septic powder. If you have any cuts yourself on your own hand, it will hurt like crazy. If you look closely, Dennis is looking at the band number. The band number will give you the label ID to write on the DNA card itself. You can see him writing in the letters and the numbers that he saw on the band. Usually the letters and numbers indicate the year the baby was hatched, the initials of the breeder, and the number bird that is um, that breeder hatched for that year. So I'm going to back it up a minute here because I want you to see how Dennis grabs the bird's nail. On the bird's nail, you will see the quick, which is a vein that contains a blood vessel. And that is the part of the nail that you want to trim just a little to get a little bit of blood out to put on the DNA card. If you look closely, you can see the white part of the nail and the pink part of the nail. The pink part of the nail is the quick, and that's where the blood is going to come out if you trim that just a little. Now it is extremely important to clot the blood as soon as you get the blood that you need for the card. This is the part that scares a lot of customers. Parrots are extremely sensitive, and if they lose just enough blood, they can go into shock. So this definitely has to be a quick process. You have to know what you're doing to get just the right amount of blood out and then to stop the blood immediately. We can watch Dennis DNA another bird. As you can see, this is a quick process. I do get questions of whether or not this hurts the bird. This typically does not hurt the bird. What hurts the most and actually what stings the most is the septic powder that you put to stop the blood. It's like a peroxide. So they might bite their toenail sometimes, but that is completely normal. Here is a closer look at Dennis clotting the blood. You always want to make sure that you fill out all of the cards fully and correctly. There is also an animal genetic sheet where you will write each and every card that you have filled out for the DNA sexing. Now, Animal Genetics is a company that we use. I love Animal Genetics. I've used them for many years. There are um, other breeders, other 
stores that use a company in Canada. I do not know the name of that company off the top of my head, but there is another company that exists. The last step is to pack everything up and mail it to the address on the card.